hello everyone thank you very much for coming back to my channel if it is your first time please don't forget to subscribe and today i have an interesting story make sure you watch to the end sylvia is 13 years old so at 12 when most girls are playing with dolls still sylvia found herself in a very adult situation by being pregnant and now she has a two-month-old son, Raul. Now, as you can imagine, this is some difficult time for young Sylvia at 13. But what makes this even harder is that Sylvia does not know who her son's father is. It could be one of two teen boys, either a 15-year-old named Justin or his 16-year-old best friend, Gerard. We're going to meet both of them in a moment, but first take a look at this 13-year-old mother's story. My name is Sylvia and I got pregnant at 12 years old. I'm 13 years old and I have a two-month-old baby. I'm so young I wasn't supposed to have a kid. And it's so hard being a kid and having a kid. I should have listened to my mom when she told me not to have sex. I don't know who my baby's father is. I didn't have a father growing up and I want my baby to have one. It's between two guys, 15-year-old Justin and 16-year-old Gerard. I gave up everything, my school, my friends. I cry all the time and I can't take this. I want it to be Justin's because I know he'll care about my baby and he'll love him. But I don't want it to be Gerard's because I know he won't love it at all. Gerard will be a bad dad and I don't want him to be the father. I love my baby to death, but I'm so young and I just wish I never had sex. Now, when you got pregnant, who did you first think of as, as the father? Um, I thought it was Gerard's. Why? Because the condom broke. When, all of a sudden, do you think it may not be Gerard's? Because the baby doesn't look like he's mixed. He doesn't look like he's black. He looks like he's white. Now, what was going on? Were you seeing both Justin and Gerard at the same time? No, I had barely knew Justin. So why do you think he's the father? Because the baby looks more like Justin. But you must have had sex with him and Gerard at about the same time, didn't you? <laughs> Was it just one time with each? Was it more? No, it was two times with Gerard and one with Justin. Do you go to school? You don't go to school? So you had to quit school what, in the sixth, seventh grade? Sixth grade. Sixth grade. Before we meet 15-year-old Justin and 16-year-old Gerard, who, by the way, just to underscore this, they are best friends. Listen to what the idea of being a teenage father is doing to these two kids. My name is Gerard, I'm 16 years old, and Sylvia brought me here for a paternity test. My name is Justin, I'm 15 years old, and Sylvia brought me here to see if I was the father of her baby. I really don't know if I'm the father of Sylvia's baby. His baby. Truth is, I only had sex with Sylvia a couple of times, and I used protection. I really don't know if I'm the father, but part of me says that I want to be, but part of me says that I don't. I've seen a picture of the baby from my friend Justin. I don't think the baby looks like me at all. Sylvia told me that the baby was three weeks earlier than what it was supposed to be. So now I'm thinking that it could be somebody else's other than me and Gerard's. I heard Sylvia slipped around. I just came here for an answer. I just wanted to know if the baby's mine. I'm not really scared or nervous. I was at first until I seen a picture that Justin showed me. And I really think Sylvia's lying. I don't think the baby's mine. I'm an A-B student and I'm playing football and I want to be a football player and go to the Marines, but if I'm a father at 15, that could slow me down on everything. I don't want this child to be mine. I'm only 16 years old. I want to do something with my life. Here they are, best friends. 15-year-old Justin, 16-year-old Gerard. Nice to see you. Good to see you. Justin, good to see you. There you go. Neither one of you look happy, right? It's not a, not a good situation to be in. How'd you feel that when you found out, Gerard, you could be the father? I was scared at first, and then I found out that <coughs> Justin could have been the father also. Right. And then when he showed me the picture, it looked nothing like me. How about you, Justin? You didn't find out till the baby was born, right? Yes, sir. What do you think? I didn't think it was mine because she had always said that it was Gerard, it was Gerard and Gerard, but then after the baby was born, she just said, all of a sudden, she said it was me. Right. Gerard, were you all boyfriend girlfriend? No, we wasn't. Don't you lie? Wasn't boyfriend girlfriend? Yeah, we girlfriend. were. Don't don't lie. You was with. You gonna tell me how it was mine? Who, who the hell? I don't know. Who he is either. You tell me. 
Shall we find out right now? Yeah. I mean, I... I mean, I'll tell you something. I feel sad. I feel sad for every single person in the story. When it comes to two-month-old Raul, Justin, you are not the father. When it comes to, comes to two-month-old Raul, Gerard, you are the father. Sylvia. 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 I know, I know you don't want it to be this way. Okay? But at least you know who the father is. You knew it could be one of the two. Now, you all, you all have a child together. And you all are going to have to come to some kind of an agreement because you don't want that child to see two parents who are at each other's throats. You know that, don't you? Yes, sir. Okay. I'm going to take care of my child, though, no matter what. Well, good. Be a stand-up guy. Thank yes, you very much. Okay, Sylvia? Is your father or your child? Okay. What's up, man?